This is question five of the inference chapter for the regression models book. It says refer to question one, form a prediction interval for the son's height at the average father's height. Please also watch question four because it goes through basically the same exercise for a confidence interval or a expected value, mean value interval, which is basically almost the same set of steps. So here I've, I've gone ahead and fit the model with fit right here. We've done this on numerous exercises so far. I've also set a variable m as the mean of the father's height. That works out to be about 67.69. So in the last problem we did predict and then fit which was the output assigned from my linear model function and then new data that means I want to predict it new data not just the x's that I collected and it, that requires a data frame so I just put in a data frame with the single value m that I want to predict at with the variable named at the x variable. And the last time I did interval equals confidence and that gave me my fitted value, my lower and my upper. All I have to do to get the prediction interval now is change this interval equals confidence to interval equals prediction. Notice my fitted value stays the same. This is the regression line fit at the mean value for the father. However, my lower and upper intervals have changed pretty dramatically from 68 down to 63.9 and from 60, um, 68 up to 73. Remember, our prediction interval will be wider. It is trying to predict a potential new value of y at that regression line. So that must include, base, it, that must include our uncertainty in estimating the regression line plus the natural intrinsic variability in sun's height around the regression line. 